everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to Repetendium. Uh, oh, repetition, Repetendium. It's, okay, Poyo follows your orders at tax where you aim, or Beato aims where he pleases. I'm gonna just be a chicken. This is gonna be interesting. I think this is a bullet heaven, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh, let's just do the sawed-off shotgun. Oh, we can also add, like, a mod to it. So, if I switch to this, ah, they have different things. So what does Grinder have? Damage and fire rate, decreased range and accuracy. Fire build up, fire rate, no mod. Interesting. I'm gonna just do Grinder and uh, let's see. Fire your weapon clip as fast as possible. 30 second cooldown. I'm gonna do turret. Uh, let's see. Tracker tracks enemies faster. Bleed does damage, decreased fire rate and ammo, or can fire rockets. Let's do rockets. I don't know how rough this is gonna be experienced. Level and experience bar, health, shield, ability, cooldown, dash, charges, enemy, destroy, gain EXP. Destroy enemies, collect ore crystals, stay alive, ore crystals, mine to gain or yet or an EXP. Events. Cool. I'm just gonna dive into this. It looks cute. Uh <laughs> the story behind me finding this game is, I don't know, slightly different. Uh not that unusual. Okay, so that's how we mine. Okay, so I'm gonna turn down these sound effects. Frankly, I'm probably going to just turn the whole thing down a smidge. Uh, but I'm just, I am not a fan of repetitive sound effects. I know some people don't get bothered by them, but I do. Okay, so how do I use my turret? Oh! Okay. Triple damage. Uh, summon a robotic companion that attacks the nearest enemy. When your hit points are reduced to zero, no, reach attacks. Reflect off walls. No, let's grab uh, a robotic companion. That sounds sufficiently handy. Okay, so I'm just gonna mine these. So we're looking for events and other things that can happen too. But yeah, this robotic companion is gonna be handy. I, I'm a. Uh... Oh yeah, we do actually have to worry about line of sight here. HP regen dashes max HP. Let's go, let's go for this. Well, luckily, my enemies are pretty stupid. I'm curious how I get my turret. Okay, I gotta check how to play again. Uh, let's see. Melee dig specialist shift event direction pick up. Cause yeah, there is something about a turret. Unless it's that shift, I, I'm not entirely sure yet. Oh no, I did, I did put it down. Okay, or rain. Okay, uh, let's see. 10% melee and digging speed. Okay, dig that, grab resources. I don't necessarily know what ore gets me, but still. So, I'm getting... I'm getting Bullet Heaven vibes, but not quite. It's slightly different. Uh, let's see. Increased dashes. Chance when killing an enemy to gain two ammo. Uh, let's go with that one. Oh, and I see. The um, the stars mean how many, how many levels you can input into that one. Oops. Okay. Luckily, reloading doesn't really cost me too much uh, time. Whoa. Okay. There is a foe. Okay. Right. I've got to remember. Let's see, you can no longer aim attacks. Increase range fire rate and clip size. That's interesting. Upgrade your companion to slow nearby enemies and heal you. 30 second cooldown. Let's just go for the companion for the time being. And it doesn't look like it can use guns on this one. Okay, and we get another ore rain. There we go. I think I wish I had stuck with the, uh... Or I had gone with a shotgun or something. Or focused more on range. My current range is abysmal. In a way that I was not expecting. But that's okay. Okay, melee. Uh, I'm gonna go for the ore pickup range. 
the less I have to worry worry about on that regard, the better. I don't actually know if it's worth it, but it's going to save me some time. Okay, and I got to get rid of that. Ow. Automated miner is in need of assistance. Oh. Hi. Okay. Wait, we have automated miners? Huh. Okay, increased turret, cooldown speed, melee size, and digging size. Range attacks pierce through enemies. Nah. I'm here to clobber. Melee the miner to start digging. Okay. I don't think I need to do anything else with it. Let's put our turret down. It's got a longish cooldown, but that's fine. Okay, regenerate 2 HP per second, shrapnel on impact. Or oh, range attacks to fire an additional time. Interesting. All of these are actually kind of good. Uh, I'm gonna go with that considering how fast I hit. Oh, wait, oh. These slimes are a problem. Okay, good, companions. Very helpful. Uh, yeah, I don't have the range to deal with this. Range damage, clip side, re oh, reload rate. Ah, uh, drilling successful. Wow, that was a little bit more stressful than I thought. Okay. Melee attacks reflect enemy projectiles. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna go for retaliation. I've got some self-healing, which seems kind of worthwhile. Ooh, and we've got two. While reloading, take no damage, five second cooldown. That's actually really solid. Also increase EXP gain. This would be pretty good. Absorb any damage taken, apply it to your next melee attack, or Tax deal extra damage and receive extra damage. Uh, let's go for the extra EXP. Okay. Plus being immune to damage while I'm reloading is actually kind of handy. And said it was like a five, five second cooldown. There's a very real possibility I can just, uh, kind of keep that a rolling. Okay. Oh through all my ammo, I guess. Uh, let's see. Chance when killing an enemy gain four ammo. Uh, let's see. Projectile speed and accuracy. Okay, there we go. do that and just start mining. I'm really hoping to get some more mining damage when I can. But unfortunately, wow, that's like super worth it. Okay, melee and digging speed, attacks pier pierce their enemies. Look, no, let's just go for, let's just be hammer boy. Okay, is this another ore rain? Yes. Okay, there's one of those sun orbs there. I don't think we really have to worry too much about these. Rumbling in the ground, okay. Piercing, sharpshooter. Oh, okay. I think I found a boss. Alright, regen, let's see, increase clip size and reload speed. Because that seems vaguely helpful. Okay, and I'm not, I'm not taking a whole lot of damage here. Which is super nice. Okay, regen. Useful, please get out of here. Boop. Actually get my, uh, actually get my buddy down. Oh right, I have health and I have shields. That's why sometimes I take a hit, but I don't take damage. Oh boy, that hurts. 
Uh, I'm gonna re-roll these. Dirt can be cast twice. Okay. I'm in kind of weird, dire straits. There's a lot of enemies. Nope, I'm dead. Damn. I think I'm gonna try a different weapon. But I really like this. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna do normal. Uh, let's see. I'm probably gonna stick with Poyo. Okay, so here's the question. We tried grinder, but reducing my range was rough. Honestly, maybe blaster is bad. Okay, maybe I do this. Decrease damage. Increase damage, decrease pellets per shot. Fire rate, decrease accuracy. That or no mod. I'm gonna try slug. And I liked the turret, but... I think let's try Razor, maybe. I don't know if the rockets were that good. I was expecting larger groups of enemies, but I was wrong. Music's good. I'm hoping it's, you know, copyright safe. Okay, so it looks like we don't have to worry about limited ammunition. Oh, we do. I just fire really slowly. Okay, ore rush. Dashing now breaks through walls and ore. That's... That's big stuff right there. Because now we more or less want to, uh... Grab my turret. Uh, let's see. Now we more or less just want to grab as much as I can. Uh, pick up range? No. Let's go for quick hands. There we go. Because, yeah, now I can mine, like, a stupid amount of ore all the time. Okay. Extra ranged weapons. Chance for attacks to cause bleed. Uh, extra melee damage and digging damage. In retrospect, that was stupid. I, I shouldn't have done that. I mean, the melee damage is actually pretty good. Don't get me wrong. There we go. What we want, to some degree, is dash capabilities. Increase my dashes by one. Yes. I will swim- I will be the chicken that swims through the earth. Don't question it. I will have so much ore. If only I knew how ore even factored here. Because, tragically, I don't. Okay, how much damage do these guys even take to kill? Not much. There we go. I'm just gonna keep punching them in the world. Okay. No longer dash, automatically nullify damage taken using a dash charge. Attacks deal extra damage. No, these are horrifying. Oh, let's see. Range damage increases by 10% when hitting an enemy, decreases when missing. Uh, bloody, eh, we can do better than this. Do this, shield is reduced to zero, I explode. Not the best. But what else have I going to do about it? There we go. Okay, pretty solid. Would like to increase my hammer's damage a smidge. If I can. There we go, max shield. and eh, melee damage. Eh. 
It's not that good. But at least now I can dig through walls with a swing. Okay, feel a rumbling in the earth. Oh, gosh. Already? Okay, cooldown speed, digging speed, uh, digging speed, I guess. Oh, here's the problem. I don't think I have, uh... I don't think I have any healing. I do have shields. So I guess it's kind of fine. Ow, ow, ow. My shields. Okay. Do that. Keep worrying. Okay, I'm going to use this landscape to my best advantage. Be gone. Be gone. I'm a chicken on a mission and I don't want to die. Ow, 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 ow. Whoa. Because, yeah, I have no, uh, I have no healing, and I haven't leveled up in a while, which is a problem. Okay. So, apparently, to some degree, my, whoop, let's just grab triple damage. Okay, hit points by 25%. Well, I have no rerolls, so I guess that's the best I've got. Okay. Yeah, I really need to kill this dude. I do not know how much HP he has, which is part of my issue. Oop. Okay. Invincible after taking damage. Taking damage. Enemies now explode on death. Yes. Ow. Oh, that was rough. Uh, it's just quick reset. I think I think the slug gun was fine. I think I just was digging too hard. Like I think I went too far. I will say, definitely have to prioritize the uh, heal over time effect. I'm pretty doomed if I don't. There might be other ways to heal, but even just like a little bit should go pretty dang far. Turrets! Oh, sweet. Okay. Turret is, turret is now cast twice. Picking up ore heals you. Ooh, I would love twins. But healing to that degree is incredibly helpful. Okay. Let's go regen. I will be hale and hearty. I think my turrets are done. That's okay. Yeah, so we just don't want to adventure much. Focus on gaining levels. Perks get stronger. Uh, let's see, max shield, max HP. Definitely max HP. Max shield isn't really that helpful, tragically. Okay, just keep digging through this. I hope we don't run into the next boss, or the first boss, like, way too early again. I guess it's my fault for turning into Earthworm Jam. Ooh, my reload speed is the slowest. That's okay. There we go. What is this? Oh, regen. I mean, it's nice. 
There we go. Ooh, 5% chance to crit. Let's do it. I don't know how good that's going to be, but I can see that being really solid against the boss. Okay. There we go. Well. Keep distance. The enemy, enemy variety so far has been pretty good. I'm actually kind of surprised by that. Or... More per se, they're interesting. It's not like these guys are just walking towards me to hit me by contacting with, uh, contact running into me. I don't know. Like it's weird. I'm having trouble deciding whether or not this is like a bullet heaven or not. Um, one perk roll every level instead of every five levels, which is great. But I'm gonna grab or rush because being able to destroy terrain to that extent. Might actually become a problem once we're fighting, uh, you know, Laser Face again. But in the meantime, it's super helpful. Or Obelisk has landed. Okay, 20% chance to fire twice. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, I don't know if I can do anything to this dude. Actually, in retrospect, it's probably... Oh, boy. This is how you piss off ghosts, apparently. That's the entire point of this. I got it. Okay, we've got another ore rain, which is a beautiful thing. Oh, you can kill the ghosts. I think. Uh, let's see. I'm going to keep upping my max HP. I very much would like to do some more damage. Oh, I might have to melee them to kill them. I am, I am killing them. Okay, we've got plenty of ore. Music has gone away, but that's fine. I'm just going to continue to become the healthiest damn sucker ever. I'll win this through sheer raw attrition and ore. Okay, grab that. Get companions. There we are. Looks like I don't have a, much of a choice. I was hoping my companions would be uh, a little bit better, but whatever. Uh, more max HP. Whoop. Turret down. And yeah, having 200 HP means every single one of these heals me for, like, a lot. Yet the music is just totally, uh, totally left. That's a shame. It was kind of delightful in its own way. Yeah, the boss hasn't shown up, so it's got to be based on distance. Uh, let's see. Melee text, decrease your dash cooldown by a second. Ooh. That's actually pretty useful. Get another ore rain. Ow. Yeah, I might want to... I want to see if there is an... Upgrade for iframes. I'm pretty sure there is. I'm pretty sure we've seen it go by. Ranged fire rate. Ch chance for attacks to cause enemies to bleed. That's just all attacks, yeah? Okay. Oh. Robotic Companion attacks, regen more. Attacks deal more damage, but I take more. Uh, absorb any damage taken, apply it to your next melee attack. Oh, these are all tempting. I'm going to go for Alpha. Oh, it's up here.
pretty distant thing, too. Unfortunately, I have no idea if my, um... Uh, let's see, max dashes. Let's reroll. We need damage. Okay, melee, melee the miner to start fighting. Let's get our turret down. Okay. I'm just going to keep yeeting slimes if I can. Pick up radius. 10% chance to crit. I like the shrap shrapnel shards, but let's, uh... Let's go high crit here, if I can. Now I'm just invulnerable. Well, that's helpful. I don't know how long I'm invulnerable for, but, uh... I sure as heck am going to utilize this to the best of my ability. Okay. Uh, HP by more. Drilling failed. Yeah, no kidding. Well, at least we get some ore from it. So we get a turret. And I guess we get to fight things. Unfortunately, I'm not. Oh, gosh. Uh, let's see. Grace is interesting. I'm gonna snag it. Okay. Just snag a ton of HP. Yeah, I think the problem is I haven't gotten a whole lot of direct damage ups. If we can get the uh, ranged attacks pierce, I think I might want to snag that. Uh-oh. And something is now resonating in the distance. You're new! <gasps> Alright, I'm going to do one more. Uh... Now, the problem with this guy is... Increase pellets per shot. Clip size is only two. That's rough. So... Yeah, what I want is stuff like the long gun or the SMG, but I think they're not in the game yet. So stuff like this would have me reloading often. But I would do a ton of damage with every shot. I'm going to snag overkill. Actually, I'm going to go back to the chicken. Sawn off, overkill. And... Oh, what are these? Single bullet with full clips damage. Twice as many bullets, but he can't move until it's fired. Okay, what about barrier? Enemies touching the barrier slow down knock back. Damages and stuns enemies when it expires. I think I'm going to go with this, but this time we're going to do rockets. Razor wasn't that helpful. We needed an AoE. Pretty bad. I think we needed pierce. We had a decent amount of HP. But ultimately fell short in terms of damage. Okay. Well, if I can get the piercing, maybe we'll be good. Uh, let's see. Killing enemies with a ranged attack? Eh. Let's go with reflection. 
Uh, let's see. Unfortunately, I don't think I quite have the range that I'm looking for on all of this, but maybe it'll be fine. Okay. Chance when killing an enemy gain to ammo. Actually, I'm going to go for Lucky Clip. Because if I can max that out, we just don't have to reload as much. Which is kind of helpful. Especially if I kill. Which, maybe not now, but later? Maybe. I would like to see some more unique powers. For the... Uh, for like, weapon and damage. So far it's been just all damage. Slow, stun, or pick up radius? Nah. I don't know if... This does what I think it does, but I think I want it. Because either that increases the amount of pellets I'm firing out, or it straight up just doubles my overall attack. I'm hoping it's the latter. Because the latter would be obscene. If, you know, if, if it works. And yeah, last, I'm still kind of confused as to what ore does. Because it doesn't give EXP, I kind of wish it did. I almost wonder if it's like a meta progression kind of deal, but since there's no meta progression in the game, I can't do anything with it. Unless I can spend it somewhere. Okay, so what do we have? Increased projectile speed and accuracy, eh. Max HP, slow enemies. I guess we'll do sharpshooter. I mean, credit where credit is due, like, I've got some punch. There we go. And part of the reason why I chose this game, uh, oh right, I, did I actually tell the story for, like, why I chose to play this game? Uh, not that it was, like, much of a story to tell, but, uh, the developers followed me on Twitter, and I'm just like, oh, that's a neat looking game. And then just, almost immediately, I'm like, oh, I need to record this. This seems, like, really fun. I might have also based some of that off of the fact that you play as a chicken. And, like, kind of a cute one. Like, some games I'm like, eh, I don't know. Weird animal creature. Don't really care. This one I'm super down for. Turrets cast twice. Or gamma. Robotic companion that mines. Now let's grab this one. Okay. Yeah, I guess they're just going to ruin anything in the immediate area, which is good. I certainly dig those rockets. There's some kind of inherent risk. Yeah, like I said. There's kind of an inherent risk to the turret power-up as it summons a boss, and I'm not entirely sure how the bosses scale, but my expert opinion, they kind of don't. Okay, snag this. Max shield, cool turret cooldown. Okay, so these crystals freaking hurt. And are just going to mess me up. Whoop. Ow. That's a bad place to be. Yeah, I shouldn't have been ext overextending. But I also feel like the bosses should show up at a specified time. Okay. Oh, well, that's useful to know. Okay, I gotta go for the regen, otherwise I die. Oh, boss is dead. That's a new one. Dashes, melee speed. Maybe it's because I killed him early. Uh, let's see. Let's go, uh, force field. Because that's actually really helpful. There we go. 
I enjoy the shotgun in this. You really can just yote a dude into oblivion. Alright. Well, in that case, I'm feeling a bit bolder. We've killed a boss already. That doesn't happen often. Okay. What do we have? Crit, shrapnel, shard. Okay. Who made the scorpions? Oh, infinite ammo. Well, that's appreciated. There we go. Ranged attacks have a chance of firing a homing rocket. Well, that's really good. Okay. Let's just plow through a bunch of these guys. I was hoping we get an event, but... There it is. Okay. Uh, let's see. Pierce, Pierce. Fire rate would be nice. Being able to hit multiple enemies with my blasts is invaluable. I think it also includes my, um... My turrets? Okay. I hate these crystals. Oh! I died. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. Well, I did reasonably well. I think I was just being too... Uh, too aggressive. Uh... And some other things, to be honest. Okay, so... Mostly, I... I... <laughs> I just wasn't paying attention to my HP. I was just like, I gotta get them off the point so I can get the cool perks. I really like this game. It's very rough. And I'm not sure what ore does. I'm pretty sure there's no use for it. Or if there is a use for it, I guess I just haven't found it or I didn't notice that I had a use for it. Either way, I like the combination of like sort of bullet heaven, uh, bullet heaven style, like infinite enemies kind of coming at you in greater, greater numbers. But the addition of the the events, the extra goals that if you complete them, you get a better reward. I like that. It feels really good. It seems to be mostly just uh, two perks in one, but I'll take it. It's kind of a nice, uh, nice goal system. And you can fail, so there's kind of a feeling of like, I actually need to try here as opposed to just kind of lazing my way through. It also feels like uh, this is very heavily inspired by Nuclear Throne, which I love. I'm a huge fan of Nuclear Throne. Uh, not that I ever played a whole lot of it. I'm a huge fan of it. I was just utter garbage at it. That's that's the real way of putting it. Um, but I think it's a good system. I think the biggest issue mostly comes down to I as a player feel very weak, uh, which is kind of rough. I would rather have twice as many enemies and do twice as much damage. Because as it currently stands, killing enemies feels kind of like a pain. Uh, and I think maybe if I got the right uh, damage upgrades, it'd be fine. But I just always felt like I wasn't really scaling in damage, but my enemies were scaling in number in a way that, like, quickly put me in a place where I, I just was struggling to survive or chew through their number. I think that run could have done it had I been paying attention and not been too focused on my goal. Um, but with all of that said, repentum, re, re, repetendium, as in repetition, re, repetition, but also tedium, maybe? Repetendium is available as a demo on Steam if you guys want to try this yourselves. It It's definitely in a raw and unfinished state, but they seem to be updating it once per week. Yeah, so 29th of August, 4th of September, 12th of September. So yeah, it looks like they're putting out a lot of updates fairly quickly on this one, which I rather enjoy. Uh, because that means that if I come back to this in like a month, it's going to be a completely different game and I'm looking forward to that. But for now, at least, uh, if you guys like this video in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like. Helps more than you know. And if you want to see more rad new indie games every single day, then hit subscribe because I got tons of them to check out. But for now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.